Well, this this little area right here. Just pulling the seaweed back reveals not a whole lot. This is only the surface. But we got one perfect ceramic arrowhead. Oh, this is beautiful. That's this is in the ceramic period, thousand year old range. But I have a gut feeling this was used uh, during European contact or after. It might be a remnant of the French and Indian Wars when France and Britain were battling over North America. Oh uh, yeah, yep, yep. I can see the movie in my head. This is a definite piece of history. I'll give it back to the beach. Maybe a child will find it and wonder about it too. And I will get a move on here. Not that I have any need to rush. I think I have six hours. Yeah, right where these rocks are jumbled. Oh, I'm sorry, Krabby. There you go. No. There you go. Yeah. Well, that's one of those little green crabs. I thought it was the remains of the narrow head, but I'll call that one an accident. I found my share of uh, to tobacco pipe bowls from the the clay, small clay ones here from the 17th, 18th century. So it wouldn't surprise me if I uncovered any now. You just never know. So I'm not going to bother to dig any, to do any digging. I'll let the ocean do that for me. But if I did, I'm sure I would find some arrowheads, some pottery, uh, strikers for flint locks, things like that. This is a very historical place. Okay, I'm going to say uh, battery time and filming time. Uh, if I find anything, I'll turn the camera on.